Welcome back, everybody. This is Beefo Buckner 7 with Nuntar. Hello. This time I didn't forget you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, so we are doing Wonder Quest, the Master Orion Quest, to be more precise. And today we are going to finish off the rest of the required rooms for level 9. So let's get right to it. Uh, last time we encountered a bunch of rather annoying horde rooms. Hopefully today we won't have to. We can only hope. Okay, so just go through the middle area. Through here, right there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Okay. Alright. This room doesn't seem like it's going to be too difficult. No, no, I didn't try to do that one first. It just seems so easy. In hindsight. Compared to all those other monsters in this level. Okay. So that's basically it in this area. You just want to do this. I think you don't want to just sit in the middle and keep going left and right because of this ball right here. Yeah. Hey, how dare you lock me out? Oh, there's a secret. That's interesting. Guess we can get there with Shen, maybe. Um, yeah, so let's do this. Yeah, so I think that's how I'm gonna operate from now on. Make sure I have a roach on my tail at all times. Oof. Okay, and I think I made it. Oh, I don't want to hit this. Okay, that's why the door was closed earlier. Um. Oh, wait. How do I kill a roach? No. <laughs> uh, maybe I need to start from this way instead? Well, maybe I just want to do this instead. Yeah, actually, I think that's what I want to do. <laughs> Never mind me, I guess we do want to do this then. Or do we? Yeah, we don't want to do that. Okay, fair enough. We want to mix them up then, I think. No. <laughs> no. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm stuck in the same situation though. Oh. Okay, I need to do this good somehow. Wait, what if I just timed it right? Yeah, how about we do that instead? Stab. 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 Wait. Stab. Stab, stab, wait, snap, turn, stab, stab, wait, stab, 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 stab. I think I can just do this from now on. I think. Yeah. Okay, that's interesting. So there's actually some tricky, tricky figuring out to be done here. 
That's interesting. Okay, I want it to open at the same time as the ball hits that door. Okay. Let's try this again. Oh, wait. Oh, not that. Okay, um... Okay, uh... I think that is... No! It happened again! <laughs> oh dear, I don't know how to deal with this one roach. Oh, this is... This is embarrassing. Okay, rotate. Alright, so it's the ending I gotta watch out for because that's where I keep tripping up. Yeah, that thing right here. Yeah, see, I did it again. Alright, so maybe if I just hit it now, does that do any good? I have a feeling that would make it not as optimized, but... No, no, maybe that's the trick. I don't recall having this much problem, um, this much trouble with this room though. That's weird. Okay. What if I just keep doing this instead of worrying about the outcome? Okay, I did it wrong again. So, okay, I think there are two moves here that I want to shave off. I think. Or three or four, I don't know. Okay, so I think I'm right in wanting to hit the orb here at the same time as those doors open, because that gives me the most time. Or maybe one turn before. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. I think I'm on the right track. I just gotta time it better, I guess. Yes! Whew. That was interesting. <laughs> okay, now we just need to get out of here. I think we just need to do some backtracking at this point. Do I need to do that puzzle again? I don't think I do. I don't, do I? <laughs> Oh, now please tell me I don't have to redo these puzzles. 
<laughs> oh boy. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh, great. Okay, so I want to go here. Get that extra rope. Jax goes here, hits this orb. Oh, wait, no, I want him to push the crate away from that. Take this with me. Turn it to Chen. Swim around a bit. Activate Lucas. Don't. Not like this. I don't know why this is toggleable. I don't know why. Anyway, have him remove. No, wait, no, I think I want that crate to be in the way. At least initially. No, let's stop doing that. <laughs> okay, switch to him. No, I don't think I want it to be in the way, actually. No, I wanted Lucas to put it in the way of the ball. Switch to Rick, activate the ball. Zipline. Then the ball's gonna take care of doing this for us. Alright, and we can step off and move on. Okay, yeah, so we had to do that puzzle again. <laughs> Okay, so... We are in... Hold on, let me situate myself. Uh, this... Yeah, we're here. So we can go to these rooms to the south. That will be our next objective. Let's go! Ugh. Don't you just hate it when those graphics happen? <laughs> Probably a fault of the Windows ver of the windowed version. I don't think it was meant to be windowed. Anyway, zip lining. Why do I want to? Why do I want to do that? Ooh, a ball. Okay, so I think something interesting is going to happen here with a ball. Hmm. What is it exactly? Okay, the ball is gonna move around a lot. And my goal is to... Hmm. What is my goal? Oh. Something has to go on that pressure plate in the middle. Yeah, probably... Probably the crate. Oh, the crate is going to get pushed around. Okay. So then I can use the crate as a means to step on to the... Into the area. As such... Yeah, I think I remember this puzzle actually, maybe. Okay, so I gotta hit this orb, and to do that I have to hit this orb. Okay, simple enough. Just gotta let myself be pushed around a bit. And step here, open this door, save, because the option is given to us. And now the roaches will start swarming. I don't think a roach can kill you if you're on a crate. Nope, they can't. You're practically invincible. That's nice. I'm invincible! Die, roach scum! Alright, so... That was actually really easy. It's kind of fun in a way that it kind of makes this mechanic work. Anyway... From here on out, uh, where do we want to set foot? Over here? Oh, I think this is actually a puzzle. Yeah, there's, there, this isn't required. Okay. This is also not required. Morning. This room is an optional challenge, only for pros. <laughs> what do you think you are? Dare you face it. Conquer it only if you want. <laughs> Are you challenging me? Well, I'll do it later. Okay, so... Alright. Oh, I don't want to do that just yet. Okie dokie. Noises. So... 
Hmm, I think I want to fight the ball, or at least beat it to its uh, shenanigans. So... Yeah, I think I want to do that. Try to run my way over here. Collect this. Okay, so yeah, the problem being we cannot set a rope when there's already one. So we want this to destroy the rope. Okay, so how do we do that? We do you that have by to the rope. Yep, we have to get to this area over here. So to do that, I want to get enough rope to get over here. Which I think I do actually. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright, I think I can. Through here. Whoa! Yep! Oh, I think I wanted to save that. I have only seven rope. It's hardly enough to go back. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, so. Be nice if it wasn't facing that way. Alright. Sorry. Um like this. Oh, I forgot to get ah oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Right, so jump over here, pass the ball, get it back this time. All right, so now collect the extra five rope. Okay, I think, yeah, toggle. Mm -hmm. I think that's it. So now I can go all the way back here. And hit this orb. Which will open the eye and the... Oh, but then we gotta be quick. But with my 20 rope, I think I might just be able to do something about that. I have absolutely no rope left now, though. Perhaps I meant to left that here, to leave that here as a way back or something. That's interesting. Okay. So now I collect this. Preferably face this way, I think. Or I could, you know, do this. Oh, it locks our way out. Oh, interesting. Maybe we don't want to get it. Maybe we do. Yeah, I think we just want to time it so that the eye dies on the guy. On that arrow ball. Yeah. So now we can make our, our way all the way back there. Okay. Yeah, I think this is where we wanted to be. Okay, so... Alright, we only have these two rooms to the east to go. Oh, that's interesting. Alright, so it seems we have a maze to navigate, maybe. Oh no, that that that, that sounds like fun. <laughs> okay. So then maybe there are rooms to the south that allow us to get there. <clears throat> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so wait, why is this Right in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> okay, 
So, more rooms. Oh, mimics. No. <laughs> not. I am not ready for this. Oh, more scroll. <coughs> Chen, what about the time theory? I saw this in the newspapers before I came to this place. Or well, what's your point of view? <laughs> Completely discarded. Some scientists believe there is another dimension called the time dimension. Everybody knows the universe is turn-based. But they say that in the time dimension there is an infinite number of turns between two consecutive turns. Impossible. In that case, the whole universe would collapse in a chain reaction and end as small as a cheeseburger. Cheeseburger? Did I hear the word cheeseburger? Wow. <laughs> so yeah, the idea that time does not move in turns is completely absurd to them. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so I think I w I'm gonna go up to the north, and thankfully we do not have to navigate any terrible mazes. I'm feeling crazy. Let's do this. I actually don't see how this... Yet again. Huh? I said you're doing it the challenging way yet again. Yeah. What can I say? I'm a delver who likes a challenge. Alright, so... Yeah, I'm guessing these are just to help people out who aren't quite as experienced with Roach Hordes. But I'm just fine with it, honestly. Roach Queen rooms on my fort. For the most part. I do end up dying a lot, though. But that becomes expected of a Daily Rooms of Death-like game. They're called Daily Rooms of Death because you die over and over again, you know? Anyway, okay, so now we're Rick, and it seems we have an actual puzzle on our hands as opposed to, well, whatever those other things were. Right, so, yeah. Okay, so now we are the priest. I think we want to squeeze ourselves into a corner, uh, through the corners over here. Now the question is, how do we do that? I I think I want to push this crate, but I am honestly rather uncertain. Okay. Alright. Don't think I want to do that just yet. Okay, so the ball is going to move around, allowing us our way back. Now, how do we get through to here? Hmm. Interesting. Maybe I wanted to move that crate in the other way. Okay, hold on. Yeah, because that way I can get the ball here and maybe a crate. Okay, so put that there. Open the door. Wait for the ball to come pick me up again. Squeeze through and... Do something like this, I guess. Wait, but we'll never ever get back there again. Huh? Oh, wait a minute, how do I get to this? Uh, seems we require some trickery in order to get to this point. Right. Right. So, yeah, I cannot move like this because of uh, this guy. So, I'm gonna stick to my previous solution of doing this, putting that there. Oh, wait, 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 wait! I want the crate to come back with me because I don't need it anymore. And then... Just stay like that and it'll push you onto the top plate. Yeah, but... 
problem being, I would need to be able to move diagonally, which I cannot actually. Right, uh, but the bull would, would push you diagonally. Yeah, but then I need to squeeze through. Wait. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah, that makes sense. All right. So now is the priest. Okay. All right, let's, let's try this. Okay, push here. Move up, get crate. Hit orb. Wait for ball, push crate. Hey, you're leaving me behind! What gives, ball? What gives? Okay, uh... Yeah, once again, a checkpoint in this room, maybe. But, yeah, it's definitely not as troublesome as those other rooms, so... I, I'm willing to somewhat forgive it. Okay, so... Yeah! Okay, that lets me go here. Save. I think I want to get a ball stuck there so that it creates a chain reaction, preventing balls from ever moving. Oh, wait a minute. That's bad. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Okay, so what do I want to do then? Well, on the plus side, we save. Okay. Uh, have it go a bit early. So maybe I have a chance to react. No, that I do not seem to have a chance to react. Oh, maybe if I could get that ball stuck somewhere, but I don't seem to have the time to do that. Ooh. Um. Okay, let's try this again. A fun thing in this game would be to be actually able to restore to the same checkpoint multiple times because that's a feature that seems to be lacking. If you hit a checkpoint, it will overwrite the last save that was on that checkpoint, so that's troublesome to say the least. Especially in a room where there's only one checkpoint like this. Okay, I want to be this guy again. Okay, so what do I want to do here? Okay, it seems clear to me that I would want some level of... Wait, what if I... No. Wait, no, wait, no. <laughs> okay. Um. Hmm. And this... I feel like I would want another crate on there. Yeah, that does not me do me any good. Okay, um... I'll try something. Okay, bring me back here. Push this here. Push orb. Squeeze through. And then... What if... I did... This. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, now I just kind of need to figure out how to get these plate, uh, these crates out of the way. Hmm. Hmm. This seems like something that is ideal. Just need to figure out what I want to do with this. Maybe do this. No, that's that's pretty deadly. What does that do for me? Kill me? Alright. Alright then. Okay. Interesting puzzle. Interesting puzzle. Okay, so push through here. Go up here again. Hit the orb. Yeah, I don't think I want that crate to get in that corner over there because otherwise I cannot go through anymore. 
Okay, so have it push Lucas. Hit the orb. Okay, yeah. That seems like, to me, the only way to do this. But then there's this extra crate, and I'm just kind of wondering what it's about, when what it's for. What if I do this? Then I can go here. Wait, didn't I just try that? <laughs> You're going to have the same problem of not being able to get past that crate at the top. Yeah. Okay, let's try this again. Lucas. Ooh. <laughs> Orb. Okay. Yeah, so it seems to me that I have no choice but to squeeze through now because otherwise the crate's going to be in the way. Yeah, I, I agree. So now the question becomes how do I get through this? Because I cannot pass through these arrows. And if the ball is here, it's going to get stuck here and never bounce back again and those doors will never open. So now I pretty much have to figure out what I'm supposed to do with... wait, can I do something with Lucas and the... no, I don't think I can. Wait, if, if that bottom crate was huh? one northeast of where it is and everything else was the same... Oh, maybe. Let me try something. Okay, so... Yeah, that would involve a bit more... Wait, no, yeah, actually, that makes sense. Hold on. <laughs> okay, um... Yeah, hold on. Wait. Yeah, so that basically goes back to what I was doing earlier. With the crate... With going back without the crate. Come on, ball, pick me up. Whee! Okay, wait, I pushed in the wrong direction again. Uh, okay. Get through this. No, not that way. Okay. Now let's do it right. Okay. Open this. Come pick me up, Mr. Ball. Okay, push it up here. So now that ball is going to push it in a way. So that should do something good for us. Of course it'd be nice if I could get uh, go alongside the crate. I don't know. It's just me. Okay, let's wait. Alright, so now let us see the fireworks. Yes! That does it! Hooray! Nontar saves the day again! <laughs> Alright, now we collapse these lava t tiles. T -t -t tiles. Okay. Clear! Whew! This this room was quite an experience. Oh, now that looks interesting. Is it optional? No, it's not optional. Okay. Um. Is there a room over there? I think there is. Hold on. Let me check that out. There's an imposter in our ranks. Oh, okay, it's a wall. Can I break it though? No, okay. Wait, I think that one up here is actually the exit area. That seems like the most logical thing to me. Okay. Alright. Let's do this thing! So, I think I want to get these mimics in these areas. But that's problematic, however, because they can toggle the lasers. So we gotta watch out. 
best to not get a mimic killed by lasers. Okay, so with that said, let's give it a shot. <laughs> <laughs> let's make sure we do not get ourselves hit by lasers too. That that would be great. Okay, so this one. Okay, All right. Okay, I don't think I can do much to save that one. Okay. Oh, it kills the mimics as I go along. Okay. All right, then. Um, I think next time I'm gonna go with this. Oh, that's that's cl that's a clever puzzle. You need to figure out which order you want to strike these in. Ooh, that's clever. That's clever. Or you want to hit two of them at the same time. Oh. So those... Okay, so I want to pair up those two then. Okay, the room becomes a bit clearer now. Okay, so... Um... Okay, what does this do? Okay, this kills that. So I think we want... Yeah, we want to sync up the mimics so that they will hit the orbs without getting killed by lasers. At least that's what it seems like to me. Okay, so... Yeah, I want this to be the formation at the heart of our operation. Okay. Uh, this looks kind of tedious though, but then again, I was never a really huge fan of mimic puzzles. Alright, there we go. I don't think you need to kill each other, dude. Uh, okay, I gotta save. Okay, so... <laughs> yeah, swords do not stop uh, problematic deaths anymore. Uh, this is slightly tiresome to work with. Okay, I got them in a good position. Push them. Okay. Ow. That hurts. Okay, um. Ugh. No! Why that one just die? Ugh, Mimix. When will you learn to live in harmony and stuff? Okay. Oof. Okay, I think I can. Just, if I could just bunch them up. No, stop hitting that orb. Okay, um. Ow. Okay, I think I got it. This I put my sword in a good position. No, it's not a good position at all. Right. One down. A few more to go. Okay, so now I want to get these two synced up in a way where they can get to that one to the top. Simple enough. I, I'll i just need to get these mimics to just leave them alone so they can be together and spend some time doing whatever mimics do in their spare time. Okay.
think I can just afford to get this guy up here. Wait. No, you can't. It's got to be two with swords facing opposite directions. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I got. I only got the wrong one in. Okay, so with that done. Wait, how do we get to that last one? Oh, I don't think it matters. Okay, so try f doing this. Okay. Okay, so now we. Yeah, I think we can do this just right. We don't need to worry about anything else. Okay. I would just like you to go down. Thank you. Oof. Mimics. Uh -huh. Oh, I he got out. So that's how that happens. Okay. Alright. Okay. Enough, no. for that. Enough for that last one. No. What? The 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 vertical one that's near the four doors can't ever go on because nothing turns it off. At least that's how I No, they they toggle. They toggle it. Oh, well, that makes it much easier than it could have been, I suppose. Yeah. I guess so. So now we can just go in here and... kill those eyes, and use Chen to get out. So now... Oh, no, please tell me it's not another one of those rooms. Ugh. Oh. <laughs> I hate those rooms. I, I, I simply have no passion in my soul for them. There's simply no place for them. They're just undesirable. Wait, what's this? I don't think this is what I think it is. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, I think this is actually a roach manipulation puzzle. But no way, we need a boat up here to... Oh no, okay, no, I was wrong. <laughs> this isn't the kind of room I thought this was going to be. Okay, so oh. I just want to hit this orb by hitting this one. By hitting this one. Okay. What did you think? I thought it was going to be like one of those, you know, that room with the switching between characters all the time so that one doesn't die. Yeah. Those rooms are just... Ugh. <laughs> they're not fun. They're just not fun. Wait, does one of them not drop trapdoors? Oh, uh, Lucas does not. Okay. Uh, preferably not facing that way, because that's dangerous. Okay. So Lucas can tr uh, pass over these things without any problem. So now we have the archer. What what point does he does he have? Guessing it's for the upcoming path, maybe. Hmm. Okay, so yeah, he cannot go through this. All right, so. What I'm getting, use Lucas to open this, then um, step there, but I don't see any way to, oh wait, no, I see it, I see it, I see it, okay. Set Nikolai here, go to the force arrow with this guy, hit the swarm. Wait. What? 
Hmm. Interesting. I should save one of these days. Okay, so hit this with Lucas. Get Nikolai. Put him over here. Oh, I see, I see it. Take this and then put him over here. Yeah. Alright, that makes sense. And now I can switch out. Open this. Now we just need to get someone over here. And get that red thing. Now the question is how do we do that? Hmm. Yeah, because we don't have any way to get to Chen again without stepping here. That seems to require the roaches being here. Mortar room being cleared. And I don't think we can clear a room for this side. Ugh. Or can you? I think we could. Just need to get these plates open. Somehow. Wait, do we want to have the roaches there all this time? Oh no. <laughs> oh, this does not look like fun. Okay, um. Yes, yeah, so I'm guessing I want to open this. But then I need a boat in order to get these roaches somewhere, don't I? Because the shallow water is certainly not going to be any help in hiding myself from the enemies. Unlike in Drawed. Hmm. Yeah, to me it seems you need to get someone up here in order for this to work. Now the question is, how do you even get up there? Hmm. This room is not easy. Well... No. Right. Yeah, I don't think so, no. I think I may be getting something stuck up here. That doesn't help me much because I still need to have a way to get it over there. Which would involve the character switching that we're supposed to do according to these white, uh, these green tiles. Okay, so let's resume this puzzle as we did earlier. Get Lucas to hit this. Step on a Nikolai tile. Get Lucas. Step on the arrow. Switch out here. Hit this. Because, yeah, that's the thing. How... <laughs> Sorry. How am I supposed to get to this without having something here? And that requires the roaches. Unless I'm mistaken. Hmm. Yeah. Unless, hold on, unless I did it in another order than I did, and do this instead. <laughs> oh, I feel stupid now. Okay, so with Chen, I can sneak through here. 
Okay, do this with Lucas. Right, now I open this and all right there, there we go <laughs> that was I complicated my life for no real reason okay let us start the rodeo joy Oh, I did not time this right. Why didn't I save? Well, at least I know what to do now, so it's not as bad. Okay, so Nikolai, then Lucas. Lucas hits this. Oh yeah, he goes here now. Okay, so Chen gets out through here. Hit this. So. <coughs> Set Lucas here. Save. Hit this and now uh, once again save. And now we will get the boat. <laughs> Don't stab the boat. Okay, now we set ourselves over here. And we begin on our little rodeo. Now we cannot waste any moves. Yeah, that seems pretty. Yeah, no, I wasted a move. <laughs> That's exactly what I what I shouldn't have done. Oof. Okay. Um, how about a checkpoint right now instead of earlier on? Okay. Okay. Um, moving up. And I hit this, and then I go here. Oh, no, I did it wrong. I stopped doing it wrong, B throw. Oh. Um, You're not even B throw. Yeah, I know, but uh, technically <laughs> I'm B throw but you know, 7, so let's pretend that's my name. I shall impersonate B throw for the remainder of this video. Okay, no, I won't. I don't even have the voice right. Especially not for that role. But yeah, um, okay, so yes, I do believe that takes care of our problem, yes! So now, we can use the archer to clear the roaches, and is there something else I'm missing? Yeah, oh, the one over there. Yeah. Okay, hit this, oh, uh. <laughs> Let's do it one more time, I hope. Okay, so I just want to head for the green tiles as quickly as possible. There's no real trickery here. Then I can't even do that right. <laughs> okay. Alright, so... Okay, now I hit this at the same time. So I can now kill this guy. And these guys. And the room's clear! Hooray! I think there's something interesting somewhere else. Wait, no, I don't think so. Maybe? No. Let's head back. Who kills Mimics? I don't like them. I don't like Mimics. I don't know why in this... In Master Orion, for some reason, they're, like, even worse. I'm not sure why. <laughs> anyway. Uh. Okay, this room. It's optional. Where am I? I'm here. Okay. We have one room over here. We have one here. And then we have the stuff at the end of the level to take care of. So I think we'll take care of this in the next part.
This has been Beef for Podcast 7 with Nantar on Wonder Quest Semester Orion Quest. We'll see you on the next part. Have a nice one. Goodbye.